So the highlight of the day is that during Jada Pinkett Smith's table talk, Red Table Talk, she confirms the alleged relationship affair or entanglement, should I say, that she had with August Alcina, in which August Alcina said Will Smith gave him his blessing. And when Will responded to it, he wasn't too happy about that because Will said, I ain't tell you you can do no shit like that. Let's get into it. funny man women are funny when it comes to romantic relationships and the things that women say do want their morals their values their idea of how relationships supposed to go it always aligns with this perception that puts them in a light of being more virtuous being the one out of the two genders who doesn't cheat who doesn't lie who who does really no wrong you know most of the bullshit that happens in relationships comes from the man. It's the man's fault. But as people who are educated in the field of psychology, such as myself, as we know, that's clearly bullshit. What's interesting about this is, first, I just got to say, Jada Pinkett Smith, August Alcina, all the women in the goddamn world, and you fall for Jada Pinkett Smith. Married, two kids, and she like 48. But it's crazy. It's interesting because this whole story started off with, oh, Jaden introduced August to Jada and he needed some healing. Your son introduced somebody to you who's damn near your son age. And you take interest in him. You want to be his friend because he's going through a hard time. You want to be his therapist. Let's look at the clip of Will and Jada discussing her entanglement with August Alcina. You now, as time went on, I got into a different kind of entanglement mm -hmm. with August. One thing I want to get clear about and clean up, one of the things that was kind of swirling in the press about you giving permission. You know, I came to Will. You know, I actually had a sit down with Will and he gave me his blessing. I said, look, Will, I really like Jada and I really feel like I don't want nobody but her kissing on my tattoos. Aside from the romanticism aspect, I really think it'll help me heal. I'm going through a hard time. And your wife, she just, you know what I'm saying? She the star in my sky. She the world in my universe. Yeah. So will you please grant me your bliss? Because without it, I just might die. Matter of fact, I ain't even feeling well right now. Which is, uh, you know, the only person that can give permission in, in, in that particular uh, uh, yes. circumstance is myself. Yes, exactly. Uh, yes, yeah. I mean, hello, duh. Yeah, see, that's what I was thinking. Who else is going to give you permission? I mean, yes. It's not like you're my wife. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I don't want to struggle this bitch right now. Her and August, but uh, yeah. But what August was probably trying to communicate, mm -hmm. because I could actually see how he would perceive it as permission because we were separated mm -hmm. amicably. Yeah. And 
I think he also wanted to make it clear that he's not a homewrecker, mm. which he's not. She was quick on that. She said, August Alcina, not a homewrecker. August Alcina said, she had a man and a son, though. Oh, that's okay, because we would like you and just listen, play my position like a shortstop. Pick up anything, mommy hitting any no time. I'm going to make this behind my time. August said, I never been in time to break up a happy home, but I am my baby girl. I just can't live alone. Tell me, Jada, what's it gonna be? She say, and then Jada come in like, no matter what I do, woo, I guess my favorite love is you. Don't want nobody but you. I'm kissing on my tattoos, woo. You and I decided we were gonna take our space, and what happened? Yeah, and then I got into an entanglement with August. That's what I said. An entanglement? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. What is an entanglement? A compromising or complicated situation, relationship. It's a love affair. Just say you had a relationship with the man. A relationship? Yes, it was a yeah. relationship. Absolutely. I was in a lot of pain, and I was very broken. Now, in the process of that relationship, I definitely realized that you can't find happiness outside of yourself. Jada, you that damn old realizing that? that? That happiness starts within? You know, women always have some kind of emotional backstory, emotional excuse that they never came to this realization about happiness and men and finding happiness within themselves and searching for happiness in men in relationships. And you know what this excuse is normally an excuse for? Them being hoes. Oh, well, you know, I was lost. I was trying to find myself. You know, it took me getting ran through by 38 guys and getting my heart broken 12 times to understand that you can only find happiness in yourself. And even though to this day, I'm 55, it's never too late to discover phenomenon such as this. And I'm just grateful that I was able to find myself and find my true happiness before I got my 39th body and my 13th heartbreak. I know now I've become a woman And luckily enough, you and I were also going through a process of healing in a much different manner. Mm -hmm. I would definitely say we did everything that we could to get away from each other, only mm -hmm. to realize that that yeah, wasn't yeah. possible. It had been so long mm -hmm. since I felt good. Yeah. And it was really a joy to just help heal somebody. Yeah. That's what you was doing, Jada? He was drawn to him because he, women come up with some bullshit ass rationalizations for their behaviors. Like they be outlandish. The absurdity is ridiculous. Asinine, extreme. Anything that y'all can tell yourself that sound good to y'all. That's what y'all will tell yourselves and tell everybody else. And only other women and beta males and simps feed into that bullshit. Altruism at its finest. Uh, you know, being drawn to people who, who need help. So, you know, I offer them my vagina and my love. And that always seems to work. You know? If you really want to help a man, give him some vagina. If you really want to be his friend, give him some vagina. I said... When he gets that feeling, he needs sexual healing. Sexual healing is something that's good for him. I think that has a lot to do with my codependency, which is another thing that I had to learn to break in this cycle. Mm -hmm. Just that idea of needing to fix and being drawn to people that need help. I ain't mad at you, Jada. I ain't mad at you. More women should aspire to be like Jada. 
sexual healing is something that's good for me. He decided to break all communication with me, right. which was totally understandable. Right. Um, and I let that be. Ain't it funny how women always want to start off with, we was just friends. Like every guy knows women start off. You just a friend. You ain't gotta worry about him. Women just be lying. They be lying. And they lie because they be with men who let them lie. See, I don't play that shit. I'm a firm believer in evolution, mixed selection, attraction. I know damn well that friendship, opposite sex friendships are rarely ever strictly platonic. It's human nature. The main thing that makes a woman want to be around you, talk to you, communicate with you, she's attracted to you to some degree in some shape or form or another. Your name, your image, you got money, you attractive. One of these things has got her interested in you. One of these things has captivated her mind when it comes to you. Women love that little, that little rationalization. They're just friends. He's like a brother. I got an ex who had a friend who was like a brother. She got two kids by him now. So y'all can miss me with that bullshit. I know Will pissed off about that shit. It's not even the fact that, okay, y'all separated. You can date who you want. We separated. She said they don't know if they would ever speak again, whatever the case may be. However, she tried to justify it, rationalize it, whatever made her feel better, whatever made her feel comfortable enough with her proceeding forward in having a romantic affair with August Alcina. Because at the end of the day, it's all rationalization. Just things you tell yourself to try to make yourself feel better about the fact that you're about to do something that you know is going to cause a lot of cognitive dissonance in your psyche. And you you want to you want to you want to decrease that burden. You don't want that weight on your shoulder. So you want to feel like what you're doing is OK. So I understand it. But we'll really take issue with him saying he gave him his blessing and I feel it. I don't care how bad me and my girl, my ex, whatever we are, is. Don't ever let another man tell you I gave him his blessing. That he could penetrate the woman that I once penetrated. And probably still think about penetrating. Don't ever believe no shit like that coming out of another man's mouth. Because I will never say no shit like that to another man about my woman. I don't care if we ain't dated in 10 years, you feel me? I ain't telling another man he got my blessing to penetrate my woman. These people funny, man. I be wondering what Jada be talking about. But she seemed like one of them... She just one of them that annoy me. She one of them women because all these women acting the same. Y'all all on this trying to be spiritual and, and trying to sound deep and intellectual and all this bullshit. Y'all ain't none of this stuff. And August, you ought to be ashamed of yourself. Jada Pickett twice your age. And she four foot eleven. And she's a hundred pounds. There is nothing to lust over. But I mean, hey, beauty's in the eye to be older. So you like them, the mature cougars who got two kids and a husband that she don't know if she's separated from or not. I mean, I mean, you need a healing, brother. You need a healing. She says she helped you heal. That was her way of rationalizing it. I ain't mad. Everybody got what they want. August Alcina's doing well. Jade is finally out of her entanglement and will clear the air. This is one weird ass family I'm telling you I mean and that's all I have to say about that people crazy man over and out